Art Service, here you go. Here's our next week, March 8th to 12th, Industrial Design. We're going to be a professional service of creating and developing concepts and specifications to design space. And you need some drawing skills, you need some mechanical skills. So on a, a blank sheet of paper, you're going to do a basic blueprint of one of the floors of your homes. So I'll show you how to do it. Here's the attachment for um, a fake house. You're going to get yourself some grid paper if you're in the classroom. If you're not in the classroom, you're going to draw it on a regular size paper. Either is fine. Now, here is mine. I realize I think i got to take this up and show you higher than my setup here. See my messy desk. This is the actual downstairs of my house. I started off with the basic outside sheet of my house, which is a rectangle. And then I've... I've valued for different things. I actually started in the garage, okay, which is we have half of it blocked off for a game room. Next to my garage, we have a playroom. And in the back, I split up, we have a pantry and we have a half bathroom. And if I was to go further to put a toilet and a sink, that's where those are. Going further this way is the kitchen and entry to the laundry room. And that's where like our water heater is and cat food bowls and things like that. This is just a wall, and a wall continues, but my steps start by the front door. Here I have a living room and a dining room, and I've also put W's. Do you know what the W's stand for? Windows. Also, I've indicated with an arrow which way my doors all open inside of my house one floor of your house or living space mapped out as best a scale as you can because industrial designers need analytical skills artistic ability computer skills creativity interpersonal skills mechanical skills problem building skills and draw a lot of blueprints so if you like to analyze space or build or design houses this is a project for you it's due friday good luck